Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. If you're watching my video for the first time, welcome. My name is Martina and for my regular viewers, welcome back. In case you guys didn't know, um, I did a video before. I think the last video that I did, it was just telling you that, um, sharing with you that um, the experience that I had um, coming through Hurricane Irma. Um, I was living in Tortola for like about 17 years and I was there when Hurricane Irma hit the BVI. Like I said before, I was on Tortola, right? So I'll leave a link on the top right hand part of the screen so you can check out all the videos that I did um, sharing my experience, right? Um, what I want to talk about today is um, being in the now. And my story starts with basically after the hurricane, about a week and a half afterwards, I traveled from uh, Tortola to Trinidad, right? Um, I, I was able to do so uh, via private jet, um, courtesy the company that my son's work, my, my, my son works for, right? What it is was a lot of people wanted to get off the island, right? And um, the the company my, my son works for, they had their own private jet, and um, they, they they offered to transfer um, the wives and the children of some of the employees um, to wherever they wanted to go. The majority of the passengers were from Guyana. I was the only one to go to Trinidad, so we went to travel to Guyana. They got off. The rest of passengers got off. And we traveled, um, we spent the um, night, myself and the flight crew, the pilots, we stayed overnight um, in Guyana and then we traveled from there to Trinidad, right? Um, yeah, so, uh, did I say that? <laughs> um, what I want to share with you today is my experience um, being in the now, right? So, um, I did also do what I want to say too as well, I did a video about my trip with the private jet and going to Guyana and stuff. I'll also leave a link for that uh, video in the top right hand part of the screen. Anyway, so as myself and the flight crew, the pilots were traveling from the airport to to the um, to the from the hotel to the airport the next morning, right? It was a Saturday morning, right? Um, myself and the co-pilot was sitting in the back seat of the taxi, and the main pilot was, was sitting in the front seat with the, with the driver, right? So I was talking to the guy next to me, the, the co-pilot. He was sitting next to me. We were chatting and stuff, having like a, you know, just having a conversation, like conversation. And then he pulled out his cell phone. I was checking whatever his messages and stuff. And then he showed me, he showed me the, the weather plan, right? The weather pattern for the next couple of days. And it was showing that another hurricane was in the air for the BVI for, like I said, within the next couple of days. And it was a category five, you know, and. At that moment that really got me so upset you know I, I was close to tears but i said you know i don't want this guy to see me crying you know and i tried to compose myself and so i said you know hey you know you know what this um expected um and it was hurricane maria right this expected hurricane is not here as yet right and i said you know you need to look at where you are right now i just flew to guyana um in, on a private jet for the first time first experience right and i also am um, in guyana for the first time never been to guyana before i uh, appreciate that i was in a hotel a lovely hotel you know a beautiful hotel right so i said you know what i need to come back to where i was right now see guyana enjoy guyana where as you know as i was going to the airport and just enjoy that now and not focus on the hurricane that was coming the next couple of days you know so i was able to do that bring back myself into the moment now enjoy guyana enjoy where as we were traveling along to get to the airport and i was able to kind of bring myself back you know to now and that really helped me you know because you know, sometimes you know we worry worry about what's going to happen in the future and you know it just kind of like avoids us from experiencing what we are what, what is happening now in our lives you know again like this hurricane uma you know lots of us are making plans to do this do that you know and stuff and look this hurricane uma i think it has basically brought us back a lot of us back to zero um to rethink our what we want in our lives what is more important and stuff a lot of us lots of lots of things and we are very grateful to be alive today um it was a nice experience um even though i wasn't there for maria um i heard it wasn't as bad but it the, the island territory was a really damaged you know so another um hurricane you know would not be a nice experience as well so i just thought i wanted to share that with you today try to be in it now as much as you can um especially if looking at the future kind of upsets you and stuff if what you're doing right now is making you happy focus on that and leave the future for the universe universe for god whoever you believe in right and that, that takes its course Okay, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.